Uh, I've noticed playing cryptocurrency, playing with cryptocurrency, really puts it in perspective how much fucking money there is. If you think a million is a lot, you don't really understand how much there actually is. It billions get moved around like fast, like fast. Like you can have a product and it can change in its value in billions of dollars. It can be worth billions more or less like tomorrow. It can happen that fast. And crypto's like shot when shit goes from forty bucks to two hundred and fifty in like a day or two days or something. You're like, uh. Some people had a ten thousand of them when they were three bucks, and then now they're all three hundred fifty bucks each, and they they can just trade it for dollars, which are printed out of thin air. I mean, this whole system is just fucking. It's like an imaginary train to nowhere. It's just this fucking train that just you can hop on, ride the imaginary train, get the imaginary money to trade for the imagine well the real life goods. So like you know, barter and trade is no joke. Currency is no joke. It's it's a great form of barter. I mean, it's so easy to be rich. And I mean, really rich. Really wealthy. A lot of people went from normal finances to super wealthy because they got on the cryptocurrency train. Buy cryptocurrency when it's super cheap. Think of it in algorithms. Think of it in magnitudes. It's not about doubling it or tripling it or quadrupling it. It's about magnitudes times tening it. So you want to get it when it's like 0.3 cents each or like a penny each because then they're 10 cents. It's, it's much more likely to go from 1 cent to 10 cents than it is to go from ninety dollars to seven hundred dollars but if you buy the same if you invest the same amount of money in a coin that goes from one cent to ten cents you're gonna make more money on the on a coin that went from one cent to ten cents than it went from ninety dollars to seven hundred dollars if you spent the same amount of money on the token and it went from ninety dollars to seven hundred. It didn't increase by a magnitude of ten. But from one cent to ten cents, it's times ten. You just times ten your investment. So think of it as that. And I mean, you don't have to go times tens. You could just any kind of magnitude. But it's about it's about uh, magnifying your investment. And. The fact that you can just create it and it has value is it's a whole other debate. I mean, yeah, you can talk about the value of money. What is money? Is you can just print it up and like what is it? Is it real? Is it value? Like what is value? But I mean you can trade it for dollars and buy milk online and they'll ship it to you and like the guy gets paid so he can pay his heater guy that ships the food that you know comes down to food growing your own food having access to your own food that's a big part of it if you want to go deep I mean I'm talking about currency right now taking it to like the real value electricity it's not a coincidence that there's an electrical current and currency is the word they use for money it's not a coincidence currency electrical currency electricity dude
money, food, fuck it. The, uh, the reason I made this video is because it's just blasphemy how much money you can make. It's ungodly. It's, it's abhorrent. It's devilishness in its deliciousness. If you like making money, if you like creating wealth, investing, stock market is fun. It's fun. But you're going to want to go to Bitrex, B-I-T-T-R-E-X dot com. And play that shit like a fiddle. Play it like it's a video game, son. And you about to get real wealthy. What's up? Y'all, it's your boy. Peace it out. After all was said and done, I hit it with a red shirt.